Hey guys, welcome back, welcome back. John Megacycle here, another episode of Factorio Bob's Mods. How you doing? Hope you're doing swell. Thanks for joining me today. Another episode. Uh, let's see here. Oh, I've got, I got raw materials on me like crazy. Uh, last episode we started up with the gems processing, and we've got a pretty decent setup here. I'm happy with how this looks. Um, the only thing I really have to do now is. Uh, yeah, take all that, some of that, and you can have the rest of this. Uh, the only thing we need to do is get more polishing wheels going like crazy, and we're also going to need the next few items for the final phase, which is going to be polishing wheels and polishing combat. Oh, this is a grinding wheel, right? Yeah, okay. So, uh, speaking of which, since we have all these assembly machines here, Sucking up 210 kilowatts of energy. I wish there was a way to put half a stack in the system. I'm not interested in speed on these machines. Oh god, what did I just do? Alright, you are this one. You can have that back and that back. I need those. Um... Since I'm not at all concerned about speed, this process can take as long as it needs to. I'm just interested in pollution control. And, effectively, energy control. Uh, boop. Yeah, that cuts it down significantly. I mean, obviously. It's a, what is this, a 60% reduction in energy and a similar reduction to pollution? That's, and still doing the same amount of work and not changing how it produces the items themselves? Awesome. That's all I have to say about that. Cool. That's a lean infrastructure right there. Producing quality product. Not a lot of overhead. That's what I call amazing. Alright, so these machines clearly aren't firing all the time. Get it? It's a electrical chemical furnace, so it's firing like a... But never mind. Anyway, uh, we need more powdered silicon. That seems to be the problem. So let's fix one production chain first, and then we'll worry about other production change. Chains. Change? Whatever. Okay, that's still researching gun turret level 5. Does this need the blue tech? Oh, it does. Ouch. Okay, anyway, back to what I was doing. Uh, what's over here? <laughs> okay. Yeah, there's like nothing here. That's right, I was waiting because of the silicon plate. And it's already a level 2 electrolyzer. Um, what do we need for level 3? Hugston. I don't think we've built any... We haven't built anything related to Tugston yet. How's this coming? That's also not keeping up at all. Okay. How do I want to do this? Uh, I don't know how I want to do it, but here's how I'm going to do it. Copy, paste. Remove, remove. Here's all the iron. There. Uh, actually, there. It takes care of that. Now, this, I kind of want to move up one. Do a little pokery jiggery here, but... Um, I need uh, an electrolyzer level 2, please. I need glass and plastic. Ugh. Now I remember why I kept all these raw products on my person. Plastic... Uh, glass? Nope. Nope. Ah, glass. Yeah, now I remember exactly why I kept all these products on me personally. Because why? I need them. <laughs> you know, theoretically, I could put this anywhere I want. Since, uh, well, that's a provider. That's a requester. Um... Hmm. This is always the problem when I put these chests too dang close together. Um, either way, do I have my stuff? I don't have my stuff. I still need plastic. 
For the love of goodness, tell me we have enough plastic in the system. Oh, crap. You know what? I don't see any. That's one of those products that we started, and we just left it alone, and we kind of just assumed it was just going to take care of itself. Uh, this is plastic. Or rubber. Yeah, that's fine. Uh, where's my plastic at? Yep, we're out. Oh, we're out of oil. And we're full on heavy again. Oh, this is such a pain in the butt to balance. And what was this? Heavy, maybe? Um, either way. A little bit of fun engineering. We can get this all patched in and patched up. There we go. That'll produce more light. Uh, water. Uh, yeah, no problem. Water. There you go. And now I'm absolutely trapped in here. Awesome! <laughs> I feel really stupid doing this. Will that let me out? Yeah, it will. <laughs> Suck it. Suck it, physics! Alright. I need, I need to pull this all out and do better storage. Ugh. Either way. Oh, I could upgrade these chemical plants right now. Let's do that. Uh, one, two. It's going to take a while for me to hand handcraft that stuff. So I don't mind if it takes a little bit. How are we on, like, sulfuric acid we're kind of low on? Oh, because we're low on petrol, that makes sense. Battery, 6.1 thousand, 2 thousand. That's fantastic. I'm happy with that very much. Very much. I'm sure we're very full on crude, yeah. So, let's do this. How much energy are you taking? 420 kilowatts. Wow. And now how much? Ugh. Okay, and now how much? That re-evened out the consumption to back to 420, but increased the speed. I don't know how much of the speed I actually need, but let's let's just do this. It's effectively free at this point. It's not costing me anything in terms of energy. It's not more pollution. It's not that big of a deal. Um, the only thing we're really losing are the resources for the chips, obviously. But aside from that, eh, I think that's a good move. Uh, electrolyzer level 2. Where are you? This is why I don't want yet another tube belt, or I'll never find the stuff I'm trying to find. Uh, okay. Uh, crafting speed is... 2.25? Crap, I lost it again. There we go. Now it is... 3.6. And, bing, energy efficiency. Deal with it. That sounds like something that, at the end of a sentence, you wouldn't say, deal with it. Bam. Efficiency. Deal with it. Like, <laughs> like do you know what I'm saying? Like, it's not like, uh, uh, I don't know. Steaks are awesome. Deal with it. Like, that. That's a, that's a deal with it thing. But it's like, I like cheese on my ham sandwich. Deal with it. Like, it's like, uh, no one asked. And also, no one cares, I don't think. You're fine. <laughs> it's, it's okay. We'll, we'll deal with the fact you like cheese on your ham sandwich or whatever we're talking about right now. Okay. A few more of these chemical plant twos give us a bit of a leg up, a bit of an upgrade here. Um, this should be going pretty fast now, right? I'm really hoping that with the refineries kicking back on, a lot of these machines should be spinning back up to life like this. And this was actually, oh, that was still turning uh, the light oil into petroleum as well. But I didn't need it. Or I don't need it at the moment or whatever. There, there. And power reduction. Thank you very much. Um, speaking of which, it's almost 8 in the morning. I, I just want to see peak time how much energy we need from our steam. 
looks like not very much at all. How many solars do I have now? I have 67 solars. Another 100? And that's going to look amazing. Um, I also want to request for accumulators. Uh, high capacity. I need 100 of these. Oop. Not 1,000. I lost the one in there. There we go. And this needs to be 125. Uh, if I remember, right? Oh, it's 125 accumulators. Right. That's right. I wanted more capacity as opposed to more production. Maybe that wasn't the thought I was going with, but that's okay. Uh, and then I also need nine level two substations, which we'll get there. Um, anyway, uh, we daydream for a little bit. We now are burning through our heavy, which is good. Uh, we're getting a very small amount of light, but we're getting somewhere. Yeah, realistically, what I wanted is I want all this to be fed back into storage. The way this really should work is this produces, puts into storage. If this transforms back into one of the three primary types, this should also go right back to main storage. Here, it's just pumping it back on the line. It's not hurting anything, but it's it's an, it's annoying. <laughs> it's annoying to me. Uh, yep, okay. It's better. It's better now that I'm getting a proper amount of petroleum in the system. I was really hoping our solars would do the whole job, but that's okay. Uh, what's next? Uh, did I produce? Yeah, I did produce more chemical plants. Um, let's upgrade this one. Same deal. Because uh, that was also turning... Oh, I can't unless I specify the thing. Okay. There we go. Uh, this sulfur and this sulfuric acid I want upgraded as well. Ding, ding. Let's see. I want to start stripping out some of the steam. We could lose two sets and still be okay. I think I want to lose this one here. Because I could take this provider chest. And I can move it. Yep, I'll take that. I'm going to bring this all the way down here. And we can lose this entire line. We could just do something like this right here. And something like this. And you're going to request all the coal that's ever been coal. Bing. Shudding. Take all that, please. I don't want it. And now, this gives me a whole line I can throw away. Um, actually, I don't care who gets the line. The coal's going to go where it's supposed to go. Everything's going to go where it's supposed to go. Bing. And bing. Uh, I think I want to reconnect this line to over here. <laughs> because I will pull something apart and I will ruin my whole network. It will happen. I've seen me do it. <laughs> it will happen. All right, our hand crafting is complete. Let's upgrade these two pieces, which I feel are a little more important to the system. And that, and that, and that, and that. Good. Petroleum, still the problem. Yep, it's still still really lagging on it, but that's okay. We're gonna burn through a heavy oil, getting some petroleum gas in the system. That works out nice. I think I just need stuff to catch up. More specifically, the oil refineries. See, now they're firing nonstop because we have not full capacity of heavy. So we're actually working through that a little bit. I have a bunch of pumps for heavy, right? Yeah, I've got one there. I've got one there. Yeah, okay. Yep, I just need to let that sit and, and work its way through. Uh, yeah, I'm building another chemical plant for uh, this. Uh, we could we could do a bunch here. One, two, and we might as well. Uh, 
I'm going to slap down this one. We're going to upgrade our explosives, which we're not even using. But I, I like the idea of explosives. I, I reinforce and I say I, I am for explosives. <laughs> in, a, in a recreational fashion. Uh, I, don't, I don't know where I was going with that thought. It doesn't matter. Anyway, <laughs> I want to have them even if I'm not using them. How about that? That, that, this... And then, all this. Yep. And then, all this. Now I'm sure I'm going to have to rerun electricity down here. Yep, that's powering RoboPort. There we go. Look at that. It's almost like it never was even here. Um, I don't want a large. I want... Do I not have... Okay. Hang on. Oh, my inventory is such a freaking mess. Um, do I not have regular drills? Huh, I guess I totally don't. Alright. <laughs> Whatever. Works for me. You don't hear me complaining. There. Kids have fun. <laughs> I don't care how long that takes. Oh, speaking of... Speaking of iron and all that is good... Um, I want this to be a little more careful, so... I need all this in my inventory. I actually completely forgot about this iron, considering we have a lot in our system still. Are these all level twos? Thank goodness. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. One, two, three. And we're just gonna do this wham jam for those. And we'll do something like this for these. Fairly straightforward. And does that cover? It does not. That's okay. Now it does. Cool. That kicked that back online. Ah, a lot of room. Getting a lot of nice space here. So let's see where we are at. 72 solars. We're getting there. Little at a time. Little at a time. Okay, next up are batteries. And I need another one. Thank you. Again, like I think I said this a few episodes, I would love it if there was a chart or a graph or something that said, hey, uh, why, why is no solar happening? It's one in the morning. Crap, what did I just disconnect? Our solar's on this network? No. Uh-oh. Uh, uh-oh. Uh, uh -oh. oh, there we go. Okay. Cool thing is I segregated the network and maybe nothing went offline. Bad news is I just accidentally segregated the network. Okay, I'm not... I'm not fond of these chests. They're cool if you want to break apart the functionality of a RoboPort, but I'd rather RoboPort, in my opinion, I guess. Okay, let's build one more layer of connection. Cool. Um, now, what the crap was I doing? I was in the middle of something, and then I saw the power, and then I freaked out. Oh. I know what the deal is. I accidentally uh, put away all my construction bots. Alright, fair enough. How many construction bots are in there? One? I gotta find at least a dozen or so more. Because I don't like having just like five on me. 
Um, or I could do could do something else totally crazy. I could just make more. So there's a hundred more logistics bots. I'll take I'll take twenty five construction bots. There, cool. That shouldn't take very long for us to slap that together. Uh, coal has been completely gutted. There's batteries. Energy reduction. Oh, that's right. I was checking the energy requirements here and I flipped out because, um, you know. <laughs> what is this requiring? Copper. How are you even getting copper? Like, ever. Huh. Yeah, I, I, I have no idea how this thing would be getting copper. Uh, 60 is probably fine. Uh, I do have some fast inserters. Excellent. Now, we're not feeding copper back into the system, are we? No, I don't think we are. So this is still kind of an issue. Um, but I could do this. No longer an issue. Steel? How are we doing on steel? Uh, not super. We're eating a lot of it because of ammunition. Uh, do I have any furnaces on me? I don't. I don't, dang it. My mind is just one broken thought after another of all the stuff I want to take care of. Um, okay, that's done. And I accidentally plucked. There we go. That gets that into the system nicely. Now, I could have sworn I had like a dump bin somewhere around here. Oh, here it is. Uh, that. That. That, that that I don't need right now. Uh, where did that chest go? There it went. Very good. Um, I think that's good. I can't think of much else I really need to get rid of to, for get rid of sake. Uh, this gets on here. Okay. Uh, next, I also want to clear this. How does this work again? Uh, no, I don't want to set a filter. I want to clear it. Nope. 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 I don't know. I don't even know what I just did. Nope. How do you clear a blueprint? I did this before. Is it... Oh, it's alt. Ah, there we go. Nailed it. <laughs> I'm a genius. <laughs> Not really. Okay, what are you waiting on? Electronic logic boards. That's right. We stopped looking into that because of our copper problem. Gun turret, gun turret mark two, fast underground belt. I'll take that. That goes in there. I really wish a bot would put that in the proper spot. This is missing transistors like crazy. Okay, let's take a look at transistors. Ugh. Production ramps up. Supply drops, everyone cries, especially me. I'm getting a good amount of silicon plate now, which I think is what started me on this crazy journey anyhow. Oh, so many little things I'm just bouncing in between of. <coughs> oh, we're fine on resources. I guess in this case I need I need more production than I need energy efficiency and since I'm saving energy so many other places in so many other places 
I certainly don't mind beefing this one up. Uh, that puts our crafting speed at 3.25, which is good. Now, what's the next assembly machine? So, crafting speed's 1.25. The next one is 2. That could be amazing, and I have all those things. What is this one? I actually have all those things, too. 2.75. Now, I never figured out what to do with these electronics assembling machines. When the regular assembling machines do it just fine, I just don't know. So, steel gear is really all I need different, right? Steel gear. I should get into the gears. There we go, 100. Let's see what happens. I, I, I'm actually not too sure. I don't need more of those. That's fine. That's all probably fine. Uh, how are we on ammo anyway? 2,000? Okay. I don't know if I'm actually going to get gears or not. We have bots? Oh, we have plenty. Okay, no, I'm not going to get steel gears. Dang it. Alright, well I was hoping a quick upgrade here was going to make this a lot easier, but I guess that's not the case. Um, this is a requester chest. Let's bump this up. Uh, 300 and 300. Uh, we need plastic for transistors? Oh, we do. Okay, that's probably still an issue. Uh, this needs silicon wafers. Why is that taking so long? Oh, because it's coming out of here. Oh. There we go. That should hopefully help that out a bit. Let's take another gander at our plastics. And once we do that, then I think I might call us an episode. The amazing thing is, I know in my head, I still need to get to the gems. I still need to get to the new research labs I've placed. I still need to get to a lot of stuff. Uh, one, two, three, four. I need to double my steel, right? Yep, steel's not coming through at all the way I want it to. Uh, do I have a splitter? I do, fantastic. It's amazing how once you get one machine set up, done. Uh, oh no, you don't set electronic or er, furnaces, duh. Um, but it's amazing once you get one machine set up, it's just easier and easier and easier to set up more stuff. I, that's one of the things that's really drawn me to this game. Is just the, yeah, it's a real pain in the ass once you get your first smelting facility. And then your second smelting facility is still a little bit rough, but once you really get a little bit going on, and you start figuring it out and you get everything moving a little bit quicker uh, it just works out it just works and it's amazing <laughs> uh, very good uh, cool we've got way more bots if we want I don't want right now I want to check on plastic and then and then and then and then and then we'll call it an episode that looks much better Okay, how are we doing on some of these oils here? Uh, 1.5k, that's significant. A few hundred, that's not bad. And this still has tons of heavy oil to come through. Okay, I think I'm happy again with this system. Rebalancing oil over and over and over and over again just seems to be such a pain in the butt. But we need to add more storage. I still, I still stand by, I want to gut that system. I want to really gut that system and clean it up a bunch. Good. That's full of steel. That's exactly what I want to see. Anyway. Oh, that's why we didn't get steel, steel gear wheels. Because, uh, not enough steel. Anyway. Thanks for joining me, guys. This has been John Megacycle. Another episode of Factorio is in the books. And I appreciate you joining me. Hope you had fun. I know I am playing through Bob's Mods. We've got a lot more to do. A lot more to go through. Lots more to discover still. There's a lot of tech. Speaking of which, my tech is dead. 
That's okay. More to fix, more to come, more to see next episode. Thanks for joining me, guys, and I'll catch you next time.